What is going on guys? My name is Hugh and this is going to be a little bit of a short video uh, for the Back to Orlando series this year. Um, I, my dad has invited me to go up to Orlando with him uh, for a father-son sort of vacation and we wanted to go check out the, or the Olympia Fitness and Performance Expo. Now we have gone to one of these before, but that was several, several years ago. And if you guys want to go check out that video, I'll leave it down below and also up in the eyeball in the corner for you. It's been a couple years since the last time I went to one of these, but now being a little more involved with weightlifting, uh, bodybuilding, powerlifting, I have some more experience going into this expo. Whereas before, I wasn't all into it. I was curious, but I wasn't fully interested in the expo. So this was mainly just a trip between me and my dad. Uh, we wanted to spend some time together. So the way I filmed this video, um, I wanted to keep the camera out of my face. I really wanted to just enjoy Orlando, you know, just for the hell of it. Because you have guys seen pretty much everything uh, every year we go to Orlando. So I wanted to drop the camera and actually really enjoy my vacation with my dad, but also for myself, without having to bring the camera in front of my face. So let's start off with the footage that I was able to get from the expo itself. And I did a very nice 4K quality video for you guys using my Samsung S23. Let's go back in time to the presentation video that I have done as a highlight of the 2023 Olympia Expo.
I had a lot more fun uh, going into this one than I did several years ago when we went to Las Vegas because I knew a lot more about weightlifting and what type of machines to use and different exercising uh, styles to use with the equipment given. A lot of those new machines I was able to try out were really smooth. They really upgraded the quality on some of these machines. I'm actually a pretty big fan of the Matrix machines um, because of the way they built them. The Expo wasn't the only thing I was able to film for you guys. If you haven't seen the YouTube short I've uploaded, I think, last week, we're going to jump over to that. And let me tell you, this little museum was pretty interesting. Uh, it's a little bit better than the Wonderworks one, which is still really stupid expensive to get into it, which I think is absolutely absurd. However, this little tiny amusement was really entertaining. It was really really fun and I really want to bring the guys with me next time if we go to visit this place again. But I'll leave a link in the description below so if you guys do plan on going to Orlando, definitely go check out this little uh, illusions museum. It's very, very cool, very unique. But enough of my talking, let's go have some fun at a crazy magic illusions museum. Go. <laughs> nuts and, <laughs> and bolts, you realize that they are actually hollow, but when you just... I can't read. <laughs> they will look like they're full of nuts. Um, are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? All I see is a pair of nuts. Climbing room. Stand, lay, and position your body on the floor as if you're defying the wall and take a picture pointing at the mirrors. That seems pretty easy enough. Yeah. Something's not right. I feel like I'm gonna. Well, that's anticlimactic. Uh, what to do? Observe the moving object. Press and hold the button to see what I have. Okay. Okay. I see nothing but a big ass blur on my camera. So I hope you guys enjoyed this really short video. I know it's kind of short and I didn't bring a lot of my buddies with me and I'm really sorry, you know, Ray, because Ray was a little pissed <laughs> that I, I didn't invite him to this one. But there's a reason why, you know, I wanted to spend some more time with my dad. I don't get to see him that often because we both work all the time. So this was a great opportunity to go hang out with them and just mess around for a weekend. And I wanted to just put the camera down. I didn't want to have to bring my little M50. Um, I just filmed what I could on my phone and it turned out great. But next year, I got some cool ideas, and I hope the guys, if you're watching this too, we'll definitely try to do something next year. Maybe we'll incorporate that little Illusions Museum so you guys can experience it. There's still a lot more going on in that museum than just what I was able to film. It was actually really crowded when I was filming all that, so not all the little exhibits were open for me to just walk in and enjoy it. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this really short video. It was a quickie, but it was a really good funny. I hate the microphone. It was a quickie, but it was a funny. <laughs> what? You guys enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you goons later. Hey, you know what's
better than this. It's family. Oh, I'm Vin, D Vin Double D. <laughs> I can't take it seriously. I live my life a quarter mile at a time. And yet I stand here like a giant ass rubbery statue. <laughs> Please subscribe to the YouTube channel and also make sure to give this video a like. If you are not dizzy and falling asleep by now, please. Uh -huh.